So what causes CFS and fibromyalgia? We talked about how you recognize it. Can't sleep even though you're exhausted and have widespread pain. Uh, key point number two, this is an energy crisis where people have essentially blown a fuse. In your home, if you plug in too many space heaters or blow dryers, what happens? Click the circuit breaker, the lights go out. In this illness, when you spend more energy than you're able to make for any of hundreds of reasons, the area that uses the most energy for its size goes offline first. And that area is the hypothalamus. So basically, people have blown a fuse. They have hypothalamic dysfunction. Uh, common ways to blow a fuse, infections. And I, I used to call this, I still call it, the infection of the month club. Every month, it seems like they come up with a new infection that this is the cause of chronic fatigue syndrome. And it's like, after 35 years of working in this disease, you realize it's not one infection. There are literally dozens, maybe hundreds of infections that can blow a fuse. Hormonal deficiencies any of a number of hormonal deficiencies, um, food sensitivities, uh, toxins, toxic chemical exposures, toxic boss exposures, toxic spouse exposures, all kinds of ways to blow a fuse here. Um, stress, poor sleep, anything that disrupts sleep. So basically, this is an energy crisis where people have blown a fuse.